Hi Year 4 and welcome to our fifth and final week of the one and only Ivan. I just wanted to say well done to everybody. You've produced some fantastic pieces of writing over the last four weeks. Really thoughtfully done, using all of your success criteria. Some really excellent pieces that we've had. I'm so proud of all of you. For our final week of writing, we're going to do some poetry. It's going to be really simple, but it should have a really good effect and it won't take you long to do. So I hope that you enjoy it. Our final task is to write a poem about the animals from the Exit 8 Big Top Mall and Video Arcade, which can be put into a book to spread awareness about our protest. We're going to do some kenning poems. A kenning is a way of describing something using clues rather than just saying what it is. Each line is two words long. The word kenning comes from a Viking phrase, which means to express a thing in terms of another. It's like a mini riddle. So we're going to always remember to start each kenning with a or an. And you can see in the example. OK, we're going to use verbs to describe nouns. So flyer to describe night, eater to describe the mouse, swooper to describe silent. And if you want a challenge, try and use some alliteration. So like here, I've done a silent swooper. Think about what the animal does. For example, Ivan protects others, eats crayons, beats his chest, lives in a concrete domain, paints pictures. And I've made my kenning here. An other protector, a crayon eater, a chest beater, a concrete domain dweller, a picture painter. And you can see there where I've used the at and an, the noun and then the verb and alliteration for picture painter at the end. OK, so have a go with each of the animals. Do one for Ivan, do one for Ruby, one for Bob and one for Stella. And send us your completed poems so that we can try and get them into a book to help us with our protest.